stabbed for just $50. Police say a man was walking in northwest Atlanta when he was ambushed, robbed of his cash, and then left critically injured. And tonight, investigators are warning residents to be aware since the crew of criminals is still on the run. Fox 5's Jacqueline Schultz joins us live from APD headquarters. And Jacqueline, investigators are now looking for surveillance video from that area. Yeah, the man couldn't give a good description of the people who attacked him to investigators because he was in such bad shape when he was taken to the hospital. Pedestrians around that part of northwest Atlanta say when you are walking in that area, you really do have to be prepared to encounter anyone. No, see, a lot of people walk these streets. You got to be very careful around him. Larry Mapp is a deacon at a church and one of the many people you see who walk and take public transit around MLK Drive Northwest. He's also one of plenty, not surprised at all. Police say a crew of robbers stabbed a man several times for $50. Plenty of pedestrians tell us they heard about the attack and were concerned for their own safety. I'm watching myself when I come out here. Sad that they would do that for $50. Yeah, for $50. They'll do it for less than that. Police say very late at night last Wednesday as the man walked along these railroad tracks behind an apartment complex off Del Mar Lane. A crew ambushed him and demanded his money. After they took it, investigators say they stabbed him anyway and ran. Police say the poor guy who was wounded had to walk half a mile to try to get some help. He went inside this convenience store and the people inside tried to help him and call 911. The man was taken to Grady Memorial Hospital in critical condition from losing so much blood and could give a good description of the men who attacked him. Investigators are scouring the area for surveillance of the attackers. You have to carry something, pepper spray, pocket knife, razors, like, and it's crazy that you have to walk around like that. Mom Nikita Thomas says she walks at odd hours with her son to take the bus and make sure she can protect both of them. The only thing I can do is just pay attention more to my surroundings while I'm standing outside that early, just be aware of suspicious behavior. That's the only thing I can do. I got a catch on me sometimes, but I ain't scared because like I said I watch myself.